what's going on everyone so in today's video we'll be in the harbor i got my not cone head wife and she's trying to freaking stick the rod on my bunghole <laughs> okay so we got our squid on there and uh yeah so let's get out before this freak freaking impales me with the rod all right here's the setup got our chunkless we got our pull holder and the marathon icentennial with the two uh squids on there look at this one turn in And the tide's coming in, about three hours will be high tide, but I'm not staying out here that long. Swing her out. Not bad. Pretty deep though. It's about three feet right now, which is plenty. Okay, put it in the pull holder. And then, you guys won't be able to do this yet. I got my bell on the top, so if the fish hits it, obviously it will start ringing. So yeah, I'll update you guys if I get a bite. All right, I'm gonna throw a lure out, my bait caster. It's the Guggen uh, casting jig. If you guys can see right there, it's a half ounce. And then it's the Kraken Crow. It's a silver and green. Don't know exactly what the name is, but anyways, let's get it out there. Let's check the end of it. Let's check the lure. Alrighty, let's get out in the water a little bit. So get out there deeper. It's pretty cold, but not too bad. Just retrieve it. Not too slow, so it hits the bottom where you get a lot of seaweed. But just right. Ton of freaking birds over there. All the pelicans and seagulls eating. I just felt the nibble. Oh, what was that? Nothing on, but I felt the hit. Let's cast it out again. What is that? I feel like I'm feeling something out there. something out there. I keep getting hit. That's right here, so we'll just reel it in. The thing I like about this bait, it's a weedless, so it has this thing right here. We don't get a ton of seaweed. Really nice. Keep feeling something out there. Ooh. They're biting. Uh, it's like right here. It 
might just be a rock. I'm gonna recast this. It seems I have got all the damn seaweed in this thing. Actually, no seaweed. <laughs> That's weird. I don't know why it was so heavy. Maybe it came off, who knows. Anyways, let's get it back out there. Not bad. Where is that out there? What's that right there? In the middle? See? There's something under this. I just made the water all murky so you can't see nothing. It swam away. Yeah, definitely can't see anything now. Oh, it's over here. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> I don't want to pick it up. Alright, we're gonna go to the pier now. Because nothing seems to be biting out here. Damn, this freaking reel is so hard to reel in. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> Alrighty. So we're gonna move over to the pier. So we're uh, at the pier now. You guys see behind me? There's the pier in Half a Bay, and on the other side, over there, is the harbor where we were just fishing previously. We got our same setup here. You can see we got the squid on both hooks, and the marathon ice and tenure. We have a Garcia Revo X 40 uh, reel. I swing it out. Alright, ladies and germs. I'm gonna throw her on out. Come over here real quick. Watch our six. Smack our head in the smack our wife in the head real quick. Not too bad. I'm guessing it's like three and a half feet. I'll check in a second how deep it really is. But out there you guys probably can't see it, but there's pelicans as always. And over here you can see all the damn tourists. And these people keep jumping off the dock. Freaking white people, man. Who knows? All right, ladies and germs, what I'm gonna attempt? I'm not going towards the rock, but I'm gonna go about three feet out. See if that uh, plant pans out. I think that's how you say it. Jesus Christ! I think we got a lot of seaweed, ladies and gentlemen. Oh man, that's a lot. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I should get my scale out for this one. <laughs> oh, it just got freezing. Okay, I'm gonna get the seaweed off and then I'm gonna attempt. Alrighty, we're gonna try it again. If you guys watched my other video, didn't go so well. So, the plan is, see the rocks down here? As I'm sure you do. I'm gonna try to go like two feet out from those rocks. Wish me luck, y'all. That is a lot better, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm just gonna leave it there. Let's see what happens. All right, you guys won't believe what happened. I snagged. What a freaking surprise.
Okay, hopefully. Or it's just a giant fish. You know, it could be a giant fish too. Oh, look at that. I'm a freaking professional, dude. Yeah, try to doubt me again. Playboy. One of my squids came off. For the record, I will never be trying that again. Okay. For the record, I might try it again. Who knows? Okay. Let's get the fishing gods on our side. Let's all meditate in peace. Let's catch a god dang fish. Are you guys with me or are you guys with me? Alright, I think you guys are with me. Please, Lord, let me get something. Oh, look at that beaut. That was a beaut. It's pretty deep. It's about five feet. If I'm going to calculate myself. Alright, I'll update you guys if I get a bite. No, no, no. When I get a bite. All right, I'm gonna switch over to, you guys can't see it right now, but let's switch over to that side. Reel's getting a little more loose. I like them real loose, baby. All right. Perfecto, then I'm gonna hop over this, because I'm so athletic, and then I'm gonna go on that side. Ready, folks? I'm gonna try this spot. Obviously, as you can see, there's a lot of docks over here and dogs. So I'm just gonna. My wife has seen a lot of fish over here, so I am gonna swing her on out. I don't know if you're supposed to be fishing on this side, but unless they tell me I can't, I'm gonna give it a dangle. That was a fucking cast and a half, brother. Let her drop to the bottom. Alright, we're gonna reel it in. Have got absolutely zero bites. So we're gonna call it a day. I think I got a ton of seaweed on here too. Which is absolutely awful. Awesome. Actually did not. Look at me. Not really getting that much seaweed today. That's a win for me. But yeah, so when I get back to the car, I'll wrap up the video. Or I'll just wrap it up right now. Anyways. Alright, what's up everyone? So we just got to the house. I uh, didn't catch anything today. I uh, got a few bites on the bait caster, but I got a bird's nest, so I had to stop fishing with that. I'm gonna switch the bait or the switch the line, I mean, on that one. I have this uh, 17 pound uh, monofilament. I'm gonna try on there. Cause I have a 20 pound test right now on there. But um I barely have any on there anymore, especially when I have to cut it off to you know get the bird's nest out but anyway so today was it was cool getting out on the water fishing fished at two spots as you guys see in the video but yeah so if you guys enjoyed watching the video please like comment subscribe share with your friends so they can watch too and we'll see you in the next one